Welcome back, everyone. We are now on to the Lather of the Loyal Hufflepuff Edition. This is a medium grit bar featuring badger yellow oats. So let's get right into this. So first of all, we have a description unlike any other for a Dr. Squatch bar. And that is a freshly baked pastry. Freshly baked pastry. One more time, let's look at this amazing artwork. What is that anyway? Is that supposed to be like a... Can someone in the comments let me know what animal that is? Is that like a badger or something? But then on the back we have like a weasel or a honey badger. Or I don't know what this stuff is. But anyway, yeah, freshly baked treats, pastries, all that good stuff. So let's pop this sucker open and see what it smells like. How about... For ingredients, we have saponified oils, natural fragrance, shea butter, cup plant extract, badger yellow oats, pumice, mica, kaolin clay, and sea salt. All right, cool. So here's your bar. It's yellow like you'd expect. Let's see what it smells like. Woo! I've mentioned in many videos before, I am not one to prefer soap that smells like food items. But let me tell you, I am very impressed. Dr. Squatch killed this bar in a good way this time. And I must say, this bar would actually be like an amazing candle or even some wax melts. This would be perfect. And it's a great time of year for this bar too. But this truly does smell like freshly baked pastries. And it also smells like this pastry shop has uh, a coffee thing that they're doing too. You know, you go in, you get your, I don't even drink coffee, but I love the smell of coffee. This smells like one of those bakeries that also sells coffee, espressos, and it, it smells amazing. Wow. The scent is amazing. It might not be my, it might not be my go-to in the shower, but I'm just going to like pick this up and take a whiff of it because it smells so good. If I could turn this into a candle or a wax melt, I really would. This is a great bar of soap as far as the scent goes. And as far as the lather goes, it's also really, really fantastic. So I think they did well on both those aspects. Um, the grit in this bar, I would say is a lighter to medium grit, but it is there. It is present in this bar. I'm really curious for you guys to let me know if you like this bar or not. I feel like this is one of those you either love or hate. I, I actually do love it because they did a very good job. There are very few bars of soap that are food flavored. I, I shouldn't say flavored, but you know what I mean. <laughs> there are very few that I actually can appreciate, but this is one of them. Um, if you guys also do like this type of bar, I, re I would recommend trying, give me one minute. This one from Hoffman's, the Affogato bar. This is a really good bar. This has even more of like a, a deep, dark, sweet espresso scent mixed in with a little bit of a dessert. It's really, really amazing. Coffee, almond, sugar, oats, vanilla bean cream. This is a great bar. And they do have this in candle form also. So something to consider. But this is definitely just on the sweeter side. They did a great job with this bar. So let me know what you think in the comments about this. If you like it or not, let me know. I'm curious to see. Um, other than that, we'll see you next time.